Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today from 1001 Sandwiches of 1936, we're going to be making the banana cheese pickle sandwich. First thing we got to do is toast some thinly sliced bread. While the bread's toasting, we're to mix together pickle, relish, and mayonnaise. Now we have to butter our toast. Now we're to spread thickly with brown sugar, slice of banana, slice of cheese, and sweet pickle. Uh -huh. Then we top that with a piece of bacon that has our pickle and mayonnaise mixture on top of it. Okay, let's give this banana cheese pickle sandwich a go. It is definitely weird. It's not bad. I thought it was going to be really bad. But the brown sugar, the sweet pickles, bacon, mayonnaise, <laughs> and cheese. But it's not that bad, actually. Um, I think I do want to plus it up a little. I'm going to use some of this Trinidadian Masala seasoning blend. It's... Uh, Got warm spices and I think it's going to go well with everything in here. Okay, let's give this banana cheese pickle sandwich plussed up with a Trinidadian Masala seasoning blend a go. That does work well. Those warm spices work both well with sweet and savory. So it's helping to bridge the gap. All right, well, I got to admit the original banana cheese pickle sandwich, I, I, when I read the ingredients, I thought this was going to be awful. Uh, but it turns out it was okay. It's a little sweet for my taste, but it wasn't bad. And I know what you're thinking, hey, they meant cottage cheese. Here's the deal. In 1001 Sandwiches, this recipe book, they actually call out cottage cheese when they want cottage cheese. So I just used a mild cheddar. And it worked with the banana and the brown sugar and the pickles. Um, I'm going to give that about five and a half. Plus up with that uh, Trinidadian Masala seasoning blend that I used a couple weeks back on the Bake and Shark. Um, I got to say, that's probably like a six, six and a half. It adds complexity, warm spices like... Uh, cardamom and, and clove and fenugreek and it was just really tasty complex and it works really well with both sweet and savory so it worked with the bacon it worked with the mayonnaise and it worked with the sweet pickles uh, the brown sugar cheese and bananas so yeah that's pretty good i am definitely going to finish that i'm probably never going to make this again but hey i am going to finish it all right see you tomorrow <laughs>